I wonder what the butter tastes like in London. Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, I'm Brit Cherie, and please hit that like and that follow, or the subscribe if you're on YouTube. And thanks for joining us today. Um, we're gonna try some Butter London lip products today. I have tried some Butter London products before, but I have never tried their lip products that I remember. So we're gonna try some. We have two of their Weightless Matte Plumping Lip Color. There's two of them. And we also have a Plush Rush Tinted Lip Treatment. And then you have to have a gloss. So we have the Pout Perfection Plush Rush Lip Gloss. So we have those. And we're gonna play with them. And we're gonna try them because I like lip products. And I like makeup. And you like makeup or you wouldn't be here. That's what we're doing. I don't know what my hair is doing. I don't know what my hair is doing. How are you guys liking the black hair? Do you like it a lot better than the red hair? I am a natural redhead, um, like super red, but I'm kind of digging the black, y'all. Kind of digging it, kind of liking it, kind of feeling myself. Let's just dive right in. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Let's try, let's try the lip tint first and we'll see. So this says it's moisturizing. Oh, and it's a plumping lip butter. I don't know. It says it can be sheer or it offers buildable coverage. We'll see, Butter London. Like legit though, I've never had um, butter from London. This looks a lot like the Urban Decay lipstick packaging. Or is it just me? Only not as cool. Seriously? <laughs> Look at that shit, you guys. They look almost exact. Who did it first? Who did it first? Who did it better? We are going to try this. This is in the shade. I don't know what shade I got. This is in the shade. It doesn't tell me on here. It's double up. This is in the shade double up. Oh, that's weird. So that's what it looks like. It looks like a nipple. That's what it looks like. So we're gonna put that on our lips and hopefully they don't fall off. I don't think they will. All right, let's see. That is very pink. It smells like, like those cheap chocolate peppermints you get at Christmas. It smells like the peppermint part of those. I'm not seeing any plumping action going on. I am very plump, but not in my lip area. So I don't know if that's something that like has to take time. Like it doesn't even feel, you know how a lot of lip plumping products, like you'll put them on and instantly like that, they start like tingling and whatnot because you know, chemicals. Um, this doesn't feel like that. There was a tiny hint of it when I first touched my lip to it. But other than that, no, no sir, and that's okay. Pink is okay sometimes, not with this eye look, but it's okay. Um, but I wouldn't say plumping. I'm not seeing any plumping. There is no plumping here, Butter London. You lie. Liar! 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 So, we're gonna take this off and we're gonna try the other plumping. I think they're all plumping actually. We're gonna try the satin matte lipsticks and see if we like those better. This is okay. I mean, it just kind of feels like a, like a tinted lip balm. So we are going to try these. I did get one that is kind of a nude and then I got one that is like a red. So we're gonna put the nude on first. And this one is in the color Clever. So clever. Okay, so this is very reminiscent of almost like Lorac packaging. But anyway, it says butter right here. Butter. I don't say that that way. I say butter. Um, er. So, ooh, oh, oh, it's magnet. Oh, jeez. 
see that. Ooh, ooh, it's magnetic. That's funsies. Ooh, ooh, okay. So that's cool. I've never seen that on a lipstick before. So this is the shade. It is a very pretty nude. And again, this is in the shade Clever. And this is also supposed to be plumping. So um, yeah, this is a matte plumping lip color. So let's put it on and see what it does. You're all going to yell at me for not using lip liner. But I'm lazy right now and I don't want to. So that is more on the orangey terracotta um, spectrum of nudes, which I'm not mad at. It's just not nude on me. It's like orange. This one, there we go. This one has that tingly, burning sensation. It does. I'm not mad at this color. Again, not with this eye look, but I'm not mad at this color. And I do believe it's trying to do what it states it's going to do, which is plump my lips. Now, obviously it's not going to give you Kylie Jenner lips, but hers aren't real. So <laughs> yeah. So, um, it's not going to do that. It is doing something. It's tingling, tingling hella. I really like this color, you guys. Now, is it matte? Yes, it is kind of matte. But not like Pat McGrath matte. Like, it still has a slight sheen to it. Um, almost like a satin matte, not like a true matte. So if you're wanting a true matte, this would not be it. And it also doesn't seem to be drying down very quickly. I don't know how long it takes to dry down. But, if you can see, it's not a true matte. It has like a satiny sheen to it. Um, but I like the color a lot and it feels really good. It does feel moisturizing. Yeah, it's pretty. So let's do the red one. I'm excited for the red one. Are you excited? I'm excited. I am be excited. This is in the color Ignited and it is looks like a deep red. Hopefully it is actually a deep red. We'll see. I mean... The, the magnetic thing's pretty cool, you guys. All right, we'll see what this looks like. This didn't say plumping on it, did it? No. 
This doesn't even say plumping, but it's doing the same. It's doing the same thing. It's warm and tingly. So this is the thickest lip gloss I have ever used. It is gorgeous. It is a beautiful lip gloss, but the consistency is disgusting. It's not good. It's bee sticky. It is super, super duper extra sticky. This, this lip gloss is extra, which sucks because it's very pretty. And I'll probably wear it again, even though I hate the texture because it's so pretty. But um, yeah, so would I buy another one of these lip glosses? No, because I don't like the texture. It's very, 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 very sticky. I cannot stress how sticky this is. Now, these plumping matte lipsticks. These are gorgeous and the packaging is really cool. Um, don't buy them if you don't like the burny tingly sensation on your lips and for that matter not this either because they all do that. This does that as well. This lip balm, I don't like this lip balm. I think it's trash. But uh, yeah, it was not that great of a color and um, the packaging is Urban Decay packaging. And uh, yeah, I don't like the way it smells. Um, so that's not my favorite, but the lip gloss is beautiful, even though it's so sticky. And the matte lipsticks are not really matte, but they're moisturizing and I like the formula. So, uh, yeah, those are the butter linen lip products. Um, thank you so much for joining me today. If you like my videos, please hit that like, hit that subscribe, hit that follow. If you're on YouTube, hit that bell. It'll let you know when I come out with new videos. And I will see you guys 